Welcome to the presentation, Clino Fragment, Structural Comparison, Analysis and Applications. What is Clino Fragment? Clino Fragment is a proteolytic cleavage product of DNA polymerase. Clino Fragment is generated when DNA polymerase is cleaved using protease septilicin. So this is a large fragment uh, of the DNA polymerase when that is cleaved using uh, the protease you get a clean off fragment. Clean off fragment retains 5 prime to 3 prime polymerase activity and 3 prime to 5 prime proofreading activity. When you look at the general structure of DNA polymerase it has uh, three domains polymerase domain, proofreading activity domain and uh, exonuclease domain. So this is the structure of DNA polymerase where you can see on the top there is there are two domains uh, that is 5 dash to 3 dash or 5 prime to 3 prime polymerase activity domain and the 3 prime to 5 prime proofreading activity domain and at the lower end we can see the 5 prime to 3 prime exonuclease domain. This is the general structure of DNA polymerase and uh, clean off fragment has got only two domains that is the 5 prime 3 prime polymerase domain and uh, 3 prime 5 prime proofreading activity domain. The function of polymerase domain is to synthesize uh, a new strand or add up nucleotides in the 5 prime to 3 prime direction. That's why it is called 5 prime 3 prime polymerase domain. So the activity is from 5, 5 dash to 3 dash or 5 prime to 3 prime. And uh, the other other domain is, is the, the proofreading activity domain that is 3 prime to 5 prime proofreading activity domain. If you look at the structure of this clean fragment, so this is the delete, deleted product of DNA polymerase. So the exonuclease domain has been removed by the proteolytic cleavage. If you do that, you will get the clean fragment. So this has two activity domains, polymerase activity domain and the uh, proofreading activity domain, but it lacks exonuclease activity domain. So the structure you can compare here, this is, there is a large subunit and the, the lower part of the DNA polymerase is removed and what we obtain after cleavage is the clean off fragment. And DNA polymerase is the full full length uh, product and this is the cleaved product on the left side you can see the clean off fragment as the as a cleaved product and the DNA polymerase is the full product having three domains. So there are certain advantages and uh, applications of clean off fragment. The following are the advantages. Uh, it can be used in uh, DNA sequencing by Sanger dideoxy method. Uh, it can fill in uh, the 5 prime overhangs to form uh, blunt ends. It can also be used in the removal of uh, 3 prime overhangs to form blunt ends. Uh, second strand synthesis of CDNA. Second strand synthesis in uh, mutagenesis protocols. So, so these are the the applications or the advantages of clean off fragment. The major difference uh, between the DNA polymerase and the clean off fragment is that in clean off fragment there is no exonuclease domain. Thank you for watching. If you like the video, please subscribe.